So this is a video on how to change your HID kit on a 2004 slash 2009 up to 2009 Acura TL. One of my HIDs are out, so I'm going to figure it out. I'm pretty sure it's just a ballast. Uh, I bought a replacement, so I'm going to switch it up and see if it works. So I've been waiting on this package to come in. So in here is a new ballast and igniter because the stock one on my Acura TL now is no good. My tip for you is do your research and find a used one online because a used one alone was $50. So let's just unwrap this. I believe this one came out of a Mitsubishi, but it's compatible with the Acura TL. So that's the ballast. And this is the igniter. I don't know which one's bad on mine, so I'm just going to replace them both. So basically to do this, you're going to have to pop the hood. You're going to pop these little clips. And you're going to twist the wheel to the right and pop. There's two clips on this side, as well as the other side. Under the car. Let's see if I can get it under here. There are a few more clips, as well as... There's also this bolt you're going to take out. That clip. Another one right there. A bolt. And this bolt. And three more on the other side. So what you're going to need for this is a 10 millimeter socket. Those are my mufflers I cut off. As well as a flathead, and that's basically it. I'm gonna turn the wheel all the way to the right and take off those clips. All right, I don't know if you can see that, but I'm trying my best. The clip right here, flathead, let's pry it out. I need like 15 of these, so make a clean pile so you don't lose any. Two. Do the same to the other side. I lied. You're also going to need a screwdriver, Phillips, because if you pull this fender line out, fender liner, bear with me doing this with one hand. You can't see it's too dark, but there's a screw right there. Like right here. Just unscrew that. Do the same to the other side. This, this should be loose. There we go. Alright, so my hood is broken so it won't stay up by itself, but that came out. This came out, that came out, this came out, and that came out. I should just be able to pop this plastic off. Okay, now I'll pop that one out. And that one out and these little and these little support things you can just bend those back with your flathead as well I'm gonna take this bolt out I showed you earlier These are the one under the bumper and you want to pop those out as well. One. I had one on this side but I must have lost it. Broke almost every single clip the first time I did this. So these aren't that important. I'm gonna pop this one out. Okay. 
Let's see, it should be loose. So you should have a pile of clips, bolts, and screws. Try not to lose them because I lost a good handful of them. Next we're going to tug the bumper off, so let's see how that goes. So 20 minutes later, this is what you should have. I peek under. That's the ballast I'm going to change. You're going to loosen up some of these screws. This one, this bolt, 10 millimeter. One right here. And two up on the hood. One. And two. And that should free up the headlight, so I'm going to do that now. You are going to unclip the wiring harness, so right there, right there, right there, and right there. So let me go on and do that. Two. Three. So here I have the headlight. Um, this is the HID unit. That's the cap. Unscrew it. This is the whatever it's called. I forgot, but I'm twist that off. This is the ground. Take that off. This can screw right off. So I'm going to be replacing this. I'm going to unscrew the ballast. Alright, so I have all the screws out. I'll put it in this top so I don't lose it. I forgot what this is called, but... I got the new one and the new ballast. And I'm going to replace this now. So, it's really hard with one hand, but... This is what holds it in place, so we don't have to zip tie it. Like I said, this is for an Acura TL, a 2000, 2004 through 2000, I think nine it is. Mine is a 2004. This should be pretty basic for any car with HIDs. Every car with HIDs is gonna have a ballast, unless you have those fake HIDs with just the bulbs. In that case, that doesn't count, but ballast. And this thing, I forgot what it's called. I'm really sorry. So I'm gonna go on and unplug this connect it to the ballast and I'm just going to put the new one in. I forgot to put the shield on to hold her in place. Alright, that's in. Alright. It's really hot, I'm really sweaty, but I unplugged the ballast and the igniter. I remember what it was called. Now I put the new one in, I screwed everything in. Now I'm gonna hook up the harness to see if everything works. If not, I'll try changing the HID bulb because I do have a spare. So let's see. Alright, that one's on, and voila, look at that, wonderful, so uh, there you have it, that's how you change your HID igniter and ballast, it's pretty universal honestly, but this is for a 2004 Acura TL, third generation, now uh, the sun's going down, I'm going to put my car back together, and take it for a spin. So I think I'm done. I um, 
the bumper is all put back together. As you can see, let's turn it on and check it out. Alright, that's the one that was working before. There we go. That's awesome. As you probably know, these bulbs are like $100 at AutoZone each. So I went on Amazon and I bought a couple of them for $25. So. So I didn't know if it was the light bulb or if it was the actual, you know, wiring harness or the unit. So I'm really happy that I figured it out and it actually was the ballast or the igniter. I don't know. I just replaced them both. The only hard part was accessing the ballast, which happened to be under the headlight. So I had to take off the bumper and everything. But yeah, what's done is done. If this video helped you out, please let me know, leave a like, um, subscribe if you want to, I make other car videos, but I really appreciate you following along and watching this how-to. So yeah, drop a like below, subscribe if you want, and thanks for watching.